guys, Jeremy here, and it's late May, which means in the next day or so, spring turkey season is fixing to start in Massachusetts. And I've been ate up wanting to turkey hunt for years now. And this will be my first opportunity to get out and get it done. And I'm going to film it, and I'm going to put it on the, on the channel. Which means, if everything goes well in the next couple of days, I'm going to film the death of an animal. And uh, let's be upfront and honest about it. That upsets some people. And YouTube being what YouTube is, those people like to spend a lot of time looking at hunting videos and being upset. So I just figured I'd take a brief moment to address that before we even get started. And first, I'm fixing to upload a series of videos about hunting. And in, hopefully in one of them, a bird's going to die. And it's going to be on film. And if that upsets you, just don't watch my hunting videos. They're going to be clearly labeled. As far as the ethical... The ethicality of hunting, I know there are a lot of people out there that disagree with it. Um, I'm not, clearly not one of them. And I don't want to discredit them, and I don't want to be mean about it. I just want to explain where I'm coming from. You know, hunting has been a part of my family's tradition since my grandfather did it to survive the Great Depression. And two generations ago, my family hunted to put food on the table. I was fortunate enough that that was not the case for my generation. Um, but I hunted with my dad. It's a close connection to my grandfather and my father, and it's one that I hope to pass on to my son. So there is that. There is the historical connection. But there's also a level of ethics involved in hunting that I personally find appealing. You know, uh, I'll be hunting turkey right now, and I could very easily go to the grocery store and buy a whole turkey for like 20 bucks right now. And there's a lot of people that would do that and feel better about it because they don't get blood and guts on their hand. They don't pull the trigger. And look, I'm not judging them. My point is, I feel more ethical if I'm eating an animal that I killed and processed myself. And the reason being is any turkey that I kill in the next couple of days will have been born in the wild, will have lived its entire life to maturity without ever seeing a cage. And I might be one of the first people it's really truly interacted with. It's going to be taken as cleanly, as ethically as I can by me. It's going to be processed by me. And it's going to be consumed by me. So that means there's no factory farms with all the environmental conditions that those, those play into. That means there's no cages. That means there's no underpaid migrant workers in unsafe conditions, no environmental impact of trucking and freezing. And as far as I'm concerned, it is the most ethically way, ethical way that I could get a turkey sandwich, is to be in these woods myself, to have spent the hours I've spent searching for a bird, pulling the trigger myself, cleaning it myself, and cooking it myself. And if you disagree with that, that's fine. That's fine. Just don't watch my hunting videos. They're going to be clearly labeled. If, if it upsets you, don't watch it. And we can agree to disagree, you know. I'm not going to crap on your choices. I don't believe you're unethical for eating a turkey sandwich that you didn't kill. I, I just ask the same respect in return. Actually, I'm going to back that up a little bit. Look, man, if seriously, if you're eating a Big Mac right now and you're worried about my hunting videos, kiss my butt, you know. If you're a vegetarian or a vegan, more respect to you. I got you, man. Uh... I fully understand why you would be upset about me shooting a bird, but <laughs> dude, if you're having a turkey sandwich right now and you're pissed off because I killed an animal, that's just wrong, man. That's just wrong. Show some respect. Don't watch the videos. And uh, keep your goofy comments to yourself. That said, guys, here's to a successful turkey season, right?